Ball to one in the middle of Marble. Bailey's the man that does that to Neil. He didn't have it there, Neil. And Harris knew they were going to do the one two. And it's 50. Ooh. All games from here. Just one left, kick three. And Lockie Neil just stretches things a little bit for the Lions. Yeah, in a sense, that that's a pretty big goal, Howie. It was a... And they'll clear. Will Essendon. Stringer work on the ball. It's taken over a bit, Lockie Neil. Has he ever? Bangs it inside 50 for Danaher. Great kick. McStay, Draper, good contest. Neil, he's had a dominant day, Lockie Neil. And he's iced the game for the Brisbane Lions. Well, Neil gets on the end of it. But what about the work of Berry? Uh, the, the hit goes to Merritt and Berry's hanging all over him. He gets set the task at half time. Merritt's running right in the first half. Look at and look at him here. He's just disciplined. Yeah, 36 goals in every game last season. Simpkin got it away off his knee. Oh, nearly 50. Cherry just pulled up last second. Neil. Reins it in. Inside kick. Skips it to Neil. He's got plenty of targets. Who does he want? Joel do. Joe Danaher takes the mark and no need to tell you he's within range, but he does like to give it off occasionally. For Stasovic, Zorko desperate to Adams, did really touch, well. Touch Adams ball. around the body, it's a touch ball. It was a clear ball. call. G. Parfit did well, getting his man out of the way. And Snarkle with him, was caught in a one arm tackle, and Lockie Neal made it work for him. Necessary tackle too, he was off, Knuckle. Harris Andrews wide, Neal's going to have to fly here. And he does magnificently. He did a good Stand. job, the little man. Wonderful contested mark. He's Neil. Swings onto his right boot. That's two goals apiece at the game. These two teams going goal for goal early. Both attacks looking dangerous. Always around those stoppages where penalties trying to get to Neil, so Neil goes to someone else. Rainer to play Lions by three goals on Thursday night football. McInerney big in for the Lions tonight. Danaher, he's been again dangerous. 3 1 so far with a quarter to play. Take it with him. Rainer heard the call from the umpire, so smashed it forward. Socket back in there and straight to Lockie Neal, who can find the footy. And I think that gives you a bit of an indication on how they want to move the ball. Lockie Neal must if spoiled by Collins. Now right goes to a one on one. Well played by Rich that time. Cute kick by Neal. Allowed Cameron to come forward. Gives it some hang time. Mixed day. Rather, Danaher brought it to ground level. Now Neil, weaving his way through. Advantage. Oh. Thanks very much as the sun switched off. Lockie Neil, too clever for everyone. <laughs> that's just too smart. That, that's a player with his head in the game. He, he knew that there can only be one recipient for this free kick. It's the teammate, Charlie Cameron. And like all midfielders do that are chasing Brownlow folks, Jordan, they say, I need to get a goal on the sheet here. They've all clocked off, Ralph stops. And Lockie says, here we go. Off to grab myself some votes. Great play, hitting the game stuff. I mean, it's pretty simple in the end, but smart play. You're right, so you look at that from a Gold Coast perspective as well. Understand where the ball is, understand who's got it. You might not necessarily know whose free kick it is, but you've got it. Cameron plays on quickly, saw a teammate surging into space, and it's a good option to pick out Lockie Neal. Uh, the three votes might be gone, but there's a two and a one available still, Geordie. He's hunting hard. <laughs> you hit that. 563 metres on average this season. And kick to kick to kick, and Danaher in search of two in a hurry. Well, Zorko's had three clearances. That, that's probably half the reason he's been pushed up the field. Neil 
pulls it back. Lovely kick and stuck. For the big man to get forward, trying to set it up. Off the fist of four. And it broke into space for the Swans. Can they get the shot away? No, they can't. Coming from the blind side and getting rewarded for that tackle. Fantastic effort from the Lions. And Hadley couldn't get the kick away. So what was Sydney's strength in that first quarter was the, the quick ball movement, but now they can't move it. They actually have to understand they can't move it quick because they're playing a number behind the ball. So Brisbane turns around the corner. Up they go again. Nearly Archie over the top. Tough ball to win at ground level. Plenty of Lions there. And Lockie Neal to steady things for his team. He snuck that one home. The stars are shining at the SCG on a Sunday. Just the ability to make something from nothing, really. A, a nice clean pick up there from the uh, former Brownlow medalist. And then the ability to throw it on the foot. Love that pressure there on the outside, though. That's what the forward half turnover comes from. Goes to a, a hot spot there with a good aerial contest, but sometimes it takes a, a little bit of magic from one of your leaders. I mean, we expected a shootout, both sides being so strong offensively. Well, in recent years, Kennedy being held onto, had to drop it on the boot and did. Got it clear of Neil. What a move. He just put on Callum Mills. Opened up space. Looks for a miracle goal. It's a chance in the goal square. It's currently sit at 18 to 5 in favour of the Lions. A domination for, for occupying the, the ball in the forward half. For Terena to Neil. Tried to give and go. Picks it up one handed. Zigging, zagging his way out of trouble. Rich. Back to back goals for the Eagles. And they were able to do the quick reply, Brisbane, and they burst out of the centre again. Cameron's got back his way. Lockie Neal at a media conference this week, and he was asked about his improvement. He said, simple fitness. I'm the fittest I have ever been before. Some good numbers here. Good tackle laid as well by Cameron. Kick down the line. Picked off by Lockie Neal. And he spotted a potential infringement and gets the 50 metres he's up. The Port Adelaide fan would expect to hear some boos at uh, Adelaide Oval against the Crows. Possession number 20 and hits the scoreboard as well. Lockie now on track for some more ground levels. Quite smartly. All the players saying beauty, Noop. Well done. And four straight to 1-5 in this quarter for the Hawks as Neil launches long. I don't think anyone got it. <laughs> On call and in good time. Lockie Neal with a bomb kicks his fourth goal of the year. So two in the quarter for Brisbane. Back within a point. Pop hand to a Tom Green. Straight back to the Lions. Lockie Neal looking to punish and does just that. The Giants playing Russian roulette with their kick-ins and picked off big time here. Well, you've spoke about it all day, Lee and Kingy. Traditionally, you don't score from your own kickouts. But the Giants look like they're trying to score. They're, they're going optimistic with their kicks. That was a dart. There he is right on cue again. Another touch for Berry. Keith probably could have marked that. Elected to bring it down. Now the Lions are dangerous. Neil got every bit of that. Lockie Neil. He'll be in the votes again today, I reckon. That's some finish. It's 35 and, and two goals. He's been a star. A couple of years ago, obviously, the Brownlow medalist. Last year, he was just beaten up. Had no pre-season, come in underdone, and was...